I'm going to spray it on at all. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, I'm trying to make a flat lay and these things don't work. I mean, can we have a editorial type of vibe? Can we behave? Can we? Gosh. I did all of that and it don't even look good. Let's just get to the video. that is really good for dry skin a lot of hydration and just natural safe clean elements so i cannot wait to do your facials and skincare with fresh beauty yes <laughs> you are so cute come <laughs> here you go step down you are a pumpkin you are such a pumpkin go ahead step down you're so cute! <laughs> All right, y'all, we're back home, and I was gonna just go ahead and do my makeup, do a full face. I was even gonna pop on the lashes for y'all, but you know, in the spirit of DIY and home decor, <laughs> it's no need to do that. I know that y'all just love um, the variation and just seeing different content, so we're just gonna cut to the chase and get into our Sephora purchases. Um, I am a Sephora Rouge member. By the time you're seeing this, it'll probably be Sunday or Monday. The sale ends on Monday, um, April 11th. My plan is to have this video out on the last day of the sale. So head to Sephora.com to get all of your favorite beauty and skincare products while they're on sale, okay? I'm gonna pop the different tiers in right here so that you can see Rouge is the, um, the tier that I'm in. And 20% off is the amount that I got off. But then if you're shopping the Sephora collection, their products, everything is 30% off. So jump, jump, jump on the site, hop on. This is a little bit different from my last video, but I just wanna dive right in and let you know what all we got. Okay, let's go ahead and start with fragrances. I kinda like this style video, you know, just getting to the point. So I got a few items. I wanted to try the Nest um, New York fragrances, but I just didn't know which one I wanted. So I was able to get a sampler. You know that she loves a good sampler. My last video featured a Sephora Favorites perfume sampler, and then they gave you the certificate for the free full-size bottle. Didn't do that this time. Or oh, maybe they do, I don't know. Do they give you a certificate? I'll do the research. But Nest has this beautiful collection. Um, there's Sunkissed Hibiscus. Then there is Golden Nectar, there is Black Tulip, this is Citrine, there's Indigo, there's Wild Poppy, and there's Wisteria Blue. Let's test them now. Let's test them in Golden Nectar. Oh my God. Oh my God, y'all. This is light, yummy, kind of gourmand, sweet, but still fruity. Mmm. I think this might be perfect for summer and spring even. I think this might be the one I get in the full size bottle, but I don't want to keep you. Just want to show you all the different varieties. And if you have been um, eyeing the Nest New York perfumes, fragrances, try this sampler out. I didn't even know they had a sampler until this sale came around. And the packaging is so spring and so pretty. All right, let's move on to the next thing. All right, so the next uh, fragrance I got is the Replica Beach Walk. You know, my island girl. I grew up on the beach, honey. We were always at the beach, Megan's Bay, St. Thomas Massive. Okay, let me stay focused. But I've always heard good things about Beach Walk, and I wanted to try it out, but mm -hmm, 
I don't know. They have one like um, called Coffee Shop and like Library. Like their fragrances are very popular, but I did not feel the urge to dive in. And this time around, I did. I guess with summer coming up, I wanted to know, you know, what was a good summer fragrance? And everyone at Sephora kept mentioning this. I saw different reviews on it on YouTube, and here we are. So let's try it. I'm gonna spray it on. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, I thought it was gonna be more like citrusy because beach water, I don't know. This is nice, what is in this? What are the notes? I'm not gonna keep y'all, I can't see nothing there. I don't know what this is. But I looked it up online, sun-kissed, salty skin, memory in a fragrance, yes, y'all did that. This is like, it's a sweet, fruity, again, feeling kind of like a vanilla base type of fragrance. Check it out, Sephora. Replica Beach Walk. Okay, I've always wanted to get Jo Malone and we are not gonna say anything else. I did have a gift card and the Sephora sale was just the perfect time to use that gift card. Their candles I'm very familiar with, but the fragrances, I always wanted to try one. And this is the Sakura Cherry Blossom. I was in the Cherry Blossom Festival Spirit since I'm not in DC anymore. And look at this, y'all. Ooh. Look at this bottle. It's a light blush pink bottle, appropriate for the name. Um, yeah, it's a cool cherry blossom. Let's just cut to the chase. And it has a cap with a spray. All right, I'm going to spray it on. Mm. You don't have to get a pink uh, sticky note. Mmm, okay. Mmm, y'all smell it. It is not what I thought it was gonna be, but I do like it. It's light, it's refreshing. It gives me like fresh linen type of vibes and less Japanese cherry blossom. I was thinking it was like more like that type of scent, like sweet, sweet, sweet. But it's really like light and refreshing. Kind of gives me like a combination of floral and like linen, fresh clean linen, which is great for spring and summer. I love this. Mm, I'm about to. Snatch somebody up with this scent. Mm hmm. Oh yeah, he gonna like this. Okay, so let's move on. That's all I have for fragrance. Let's move on to skincare. Okay, the gang's all here. So I'm gonna start with the Ordinary. Uh, actually, no, I'll start with the Ole Hen Henriksen um, scrub. So I got the Ole Henriksen Lemonade Smoothing Scrub Summer Skin is loading. This is good for dullness, uneven texture. Um, it's cruelty free. One of their clean products at Sephora and has an AHA glycolic acid. Um, I like a scrub that's not too abrasive and I find that when I have used this before, I didn't have any type of reaction and it just left my skin feeling like, you know, smooth, free from all of the dead skin cells. So anyway, I had to restock and this is my only second time, this is my second container. All right, next up is the Ordinary um, Skincare brand. This is my second time using any of the products. I think I had a moisturizer before or some type of serum. And I wanted to try something new, so I got the High Strength Vitamin and Mineral Blemish Formula. Um, for marks that I have on my chin from tweezing and um, just like any type of hyperpigmentation or uneven tone. This is a good time to kind of like, you know, even the texture, get the skin prepared for all of the sunscreen um, and sun protection when we are tanning and browning during the summertime. Anyway, I also got the 10 minute exfoliating facial. There was something in here that I found very interesting. I think it was like, Berries and juices. That sounds so coming to America. It was something that makes it like this kind of like raspberry hue that I thought was so fascinating. I wanted to try it out because of the ingredients. Laciolata fruit leaf extract. Did it, where did I get the juices and berries from though? Did I make that up in my mind? I guess I saw this and said this looks like they, this looks like they got cranberries in it. I want to try it. <laughs> Anyway, these the price points on these, these are under $15. 
um, all the um, ordinary products. I had never, I never realized that. I think I got the serum or whatever I had from their collection in a, like a gift bag or something. My fashion show in DC. Anyway, the third product is the Hyaluronic Acid Hydration Support Formula with Ultra Pure Vegan Hyal Hyaluronic. Why can't I say that today? I think I got this from my mom for Ultra Hydration. Say that 10 times fast. That's that for that. All right, and so for my babies that I've had before, the brands that I've used quite frequently, um, Kiehl's, 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 yes. The Creamy Avocado Eye Treatment. This ran out in my larger jar. The larger jar was sold out when I placed my order, so I had to go with the smaller um, size, but it goes a long way. This is a .5 ounce uh, container. You only use like a little dab, a dime size dab on your um, eyes and around the eye, so this should last me a good two to three months, I believe. And it's just, it works wonders. It works wonders, it works wonders. Um, I do like this in the Olay Henriksen Bright Eye Cream. However, I feel like the Olay Henriksen, the vitamin C, I like to use that um, daytime. And for some reason, I prefer the creamy avocado eye treatment at night. Some people say you don't need to use eye creams at night, but I feel like I wake up feeling woke. <laughs> My eyes are not puffy. They're not like, you know, they're not like any like crow's feet, dark areas when I use eye cream at night. So to each his own. And then finally for skincare, look at these beauties. This is the Glow Recipe Guava Vitamin C Dark Spot Serum. Again, we'll be using this on my chin area and like anywhere where I have hyperpigmentation or dark marks. And then the other item, which I'm super excited to use, is the Strawberry Smooth BHA AHA Salicylic Serum. Um, and I plan on using one of these for my mom because it was good for normal to oily as well as normal to dry combination skin my mom has dry skin i have very oily skin so we tend to use different products but i believe it's the yeah strawberry smooth um serum that we both can use so super excited don't have a review or testimony on them i have the other glow recipe product that everyone raves about the watermelon um, i will let you know how the strawberry smooth and the guava vitamin c turn out okay all right Last but not least, let's get to some hair products, product, because it's the last thing on my list. <laughs> Okay, the next item is the Moroccan oil treatment. Okay, the original, the original um, Moroccan oil collection. And I follow quite a few people on YouTube and Instagram that rave about this. Uh, one of my relatives uses it and her hair is absolutely gorgeous. So I've always wanted to try it. Sadly enough, I purchased it when I had braids in and my cousin was saying, you know, you can actually put it on your scalp. Um, as well and you see benefits from it. So I think I'll be using a dab here and there for my scalp while I'm wearing my braids. Let's go ahead and open this up. Oh, the pump is separate. I like. I like that because when you're traveling and you don't want to have anything like pumping through, even if you put it in a Ziploc bag, you don't want to have anything pumping through your, um, your luggage. I like that, that it comes with a cap. So this is a 3.4 ounce bottle of the Moroccan oil treatment. And it says you can apply a small amount throughout damp or dry hair, style as usual. Um, if you can put it on your hair, you can put it on your scalp, so I'll let y'all know. Um, and then of course, when I take the braids out, I'll be using this all throughout the summer. And this is a best seller, it tends to go fast. The last time I tried to get it, I think was when they had the fall sale, it was sold out, and I didn't look back when it was restocked. So here we are. Um, I'm excited, 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 excited. And I think I'll go ahead and end it there. Thank y'all so much for tuning in to my Sephora spring sale event video. This was very informal, not all of the, you know, drama and humor and <laughs> stage lights from the last video, but I definitely wanted to share the replay with you before I came and showed you the additional items because my first order from this sale was just a restock of some of the things that you saw in the video from 2021. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for tuning in. See you in the next video. Have a wonderful evening. Head over to Sephora.com and enter the code Save Spring to score great deals on all of your beauty and skincare products. Bye, y'all.